Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you uh, this morning for a track review, and I just wanted to say uh, mostly because I didn't really want to do what I did last night, but I had to quit my job for certain reasons because my mental health was in decline and also work stress too, expecting to do more and not getting good pay for it. So, yep. My manager, uh, I, I fucking hated my manager, honestly. I, I don't know, it's just, uh, I will say this, Dollar General is not a place to work at. I, I tried, I gave it about three months, and I just said, fuck it. I, I can only take so much until it hits a breaking point where I can't take anymore. So that's why I did what I did, <laughs> They told me to sign this verbal counseling thing when I really didn't do anything wrong, personally. But I know you have to be there on time for, uh, like, just basically, uh, actually, I'm going to talk about this in the second section in the video. Basically, I will talk about it in the second section. I just want to at least get this track review for you guys done first and talk about the next thing um i probably will do a live stream uh later today i i haven't decided i'm gonna be jobless for a bit uh i don't know how long but i um, trying to get into family dollar so this track review and i'm sorry for talking a little too much for the intro of the video just that's what's going on and my mental health was in decline and uh, i just got a lot of work stress that mentally fucked me up. So, I'm going to discuss what I'm going to be talking about for this track review for Static X, Stay Alive, and let you know my thoughts on the track of what I listened to for their new song. So let's dive into this track review. Sorry for the very lengthy intro for re talking a little over two minutes when technically this was a track review I meant to do. I just, I will talk about the next section of the video at a certain point in the video so if i do decide to do that so basically i think uh zero's screaming vocals are pretty good i'm not sure if it's wayne static's screaming or if it's zero but i really enjoyed uh how the song sounded overall finally we got another single after seven months of waiting because uh terrible lie was the first single back in february so it's been a little while since we got a Static X song, but I think they wanted us to wait a bit until we get closer to the release of Project Regeneration Volume 2, which is dropping November 3rd, so that's coming up in two months, so pretty soon. Um, I unfortunately had to cancel some pre-orders because I am not going to have the money at the time, and I have to transfer all my money over to a new card, uh, so that's something I gotta do for the rest of this week to figure some shit out and see where it goes from there. So basically, I enjoyed this song. It's pretty good, uh, very heavy. There's a lot of electronic synths in it that sound pretty good for what it's going for with the track as a whole. But I'm not sure if it's Zero or Wayne Static. You can let me know in the comment section below. I, I did listen to it a little early because I know this song's coming out tomorrow. I just uh, downloaded it on Alter Portal just this morning, so I was like, hmm, long time no see, Static X. <laughs> uh, it's been seven months since the last single, Terrible Lie, so it's been a little while. Like, a little over half the year, I guess you could say. So, basically, overall, I think uh, this song was pretty good. I highly recommend you check this song out when it comes out. Uh, on September 7th, it, that's when it's supposed to be coming out, um, and I know I downloaded a new Corey Taylor single, that, but I'm not going to review it until the 11th, or something like that, but pretty much for a score for me, I'm giving Static X Stay Alive a uh, 5 out of 5, pretty good track, definitely recommend checking this song out, and sorry for talking about my job thing at the beginning of the video, um, we're going to get more into it, um, with what I'm going to be talking about, so, uh, basically, 5 out of 5 for, uh, Static X, Stay Alive, 
and now to talk about the next section of the video. I was going to do this in a live stream, which I did talk about a certain moment of it, and yes, I got mentally stressed out from work, and it just messed with my psyche, and I've just haven't been doing well this past summer, and been very fucking miserable at Dollar General. Um, so, honestly, I tried, I gave it as many shots as I could, and I just feel like I need to move on to better things, and the next job I'm gonna hopefully get, but no promises, it's just, it's if it happens, so I gotta wait till tomorrow to find out what's gonna happen if I'm hired or not, because I really want to get this job, because it's $15 an hour, better than what I used to make, it was $11 an hour I was making at Dollar General, so what does that fucking tell you, that they un, that they don't, uh, really pay their employees that very well, <laughs> And it was going to go to 12 at the end of this month, but I do not fucking care. I, I, my manager was a fucking bitch, honestly. I tried being nice to her. I tried uh, doing what I was told, and I can do that. I just, I can only take so much. And give me a second, guys. You got to pause the video. I am so sorry about that, guys. This, my sister's cat wanted in my room uh, for a moment. Um... Because, yeah, he gets annoying sometimes, and I'm sorry about the background noise with him meowing so much. <laughs> yeah, Titan, you've been meowing too much. Well, he's a sweet sweetheart, but he can get annoying at times. But still, um, my job was affecting my mental health and my psyche a bit, and pretty much the medicine I'm on has been helping. Uh, kind of making me think a lot of paranoia things, paranoia, getting a little paranoid of it, and I've had some mini episodes, like mental breakdown episodes mostly, not gonna say what it is, it's just that's between me, my family, and friends, what I really do have, but I really don't want to disclose that information on the internet, because some people will have a stigma about it, and kind of be like, oh, he's crazy, kind of thing, uh, it's just, I don't really want to reveal that info, hopefully you can respect my privacy on that, um, because that's between me, my family, and friends that I can trust, hopefully you can respect that, uh, pretty much was what I was dealing with, I had to, this is the thing, corporate's been up my boss's butt, my previous boss's ass, and then she gets on her ass for expecting to do more, and I understand what she's doing, she's trying to get us to pick up the pace, I've been trying, it's just... I don't know, lately I've just been very sluggish, and I actually wanted to almost do nothing yesterday just to piss her off even more, which they weren't happy about me dumping expired milk out in a water fountain, uh, which I wasn't thinking then, I should have dumped it out in the back room, but still, I Dollar General sucks, and honestly, I'm going to... My job experience there, I'd give it a 4 out of 10. I mean, some of the, you know, well, maybe 4.5 uh, at least. I will tell you why management and corporate are the worst fucking things about the job. And I know it happens at every job. But pretty much, sometimes if you really want to make money, you got to take shit. And uh, take the shit mostly and just do your job. Because that's the shittiest part about some companies nowadays. You have to take shit in order to get paid. <laughs> it's like... That's not really healthy and easy to do <laughs> at times. Because some people will have their breaking points and say enough's enough. So, honestly, I'm at that stage where I'm going to try Family Dollar if it doesn't work out. And something happens, which I want to at least stay there a little bit, I only stayed at Dollar General for like a few months, just so you know, uh, but pretty much, I will talk more into 
what I think of my experience. Customers were nice at Dollar General. Some of my coworkers were nice. Uh, I'm going to miss a few of them, just so you know. Because um, there's a few that I actually really enjoyed working with. But there are... <sighs> There are some managers out there that are total pricks, in my opinion. So, with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this track review slash my experience at Dollar General. I quit, mostly, or whatever. Um, so, with that being said, thank you for watching this kind of lengthy video. I'll see you in the next video.